Now, guys, here's an open table, so you don't have to be all at one table if you think it's going to be too loud for you to discuss. So move to another table if you need to. Who was it with, Enrique? Okay, go ahead. And you can sit there, honey, if you need. All right, so you're picking up where we were yesterday. I know we didn't have a lot of time, but if you need to go back and reread that top paragraph again and go and start that, then do that, okay? And then you have your side notes. Some of you did your notes last night, so make sure you have those out so you know what to say to some your partner if you need to add to your annotating, okay? And I'll come around. And Mr. McDougall will be coming around, too, to check to make sure you're on the right track. And we want to hear some good conversations of what you're annotating. Okay? Go ahead and start. A proportional relationship between two quantities is one in each. The two quantities vary directly with one and the other. If and one item is doubled, the other related item is also doubled. Because of this, it is also called a direct variation. The equation such relation, relationships are always in the form y equals mx. In the graph pro, produ, pro, produce a line produce a line that passes through the origin. In the equation, m is the slope of the line, and it is also called the unit rate. The rate of change, or the constant proportionality of the function. Okay, so like I said earlier, you used red and I used blue, so then we'll change the colors. So we'll just use yellow. So we need to know a proportional relationship, so we can highlight that. Um... What do you think a unit rate is? A unit rate is the, the number that is like different. For example, I think is um like the number on the top, like the lowest number, and the higher is the bottom. And then like like Miss Harmon says, like when you see a unit rate, I think you have to cross and multiply. And I think she meant like it's, that, or was just. It's kind of like that, which your example is two cats over five dogs, which a unit rate is like per one. Oh. My example is 60 kids per one classroom. Mm -hmm. Or you can put like part three classrooms and then divide it smaller, which would be 20 kids per one classroom, kind of like mm -hmm. that. Australia, Alright, that's time. Where do we read it anyway? We read it twice, so. Alright, I need for you to look up here yeah. on the board. And I have annotated for you. And this is a little different annotation. It has my little side notes over to the side. Mm -hmm. I have highlighted my own stuff. Mm -hmm. I highlighted a proportional relationship. Mm -hmm. Very directly in direct variation, these three things I put together to make sure to make sure that we have all the words that we will be seeing. That means the same thing. So my little side note says means the same thing. So where you would have wrote a line out to the side and said these three words mean the same thing. I just wrote it as a little side note with this type of annotation. <laughs>